he stays most uh, most weekends here at Sebring. We're we're a little further away uh, in a camper. I'm in a La Quinta this weekend. Ah. That is Ernie Wilding in a 1995 BMW M3. We're doing Group 812. But this man right here, hey, Tony Garcia, you're going to like the man next. Look at that thumbs up right there from Ernie Wilding. But let's get a shot to the car to the right. Ah, oh, yes. Name wrong. Johannes Goglica says, it's not Irish. And then another What's person says, Irish? the uh, Cloverleaf. Oh, right. Then the other person said, apparently... Savachi was so fed up of his bad luck that he decided to add a symbol of luck to his Alfa Romeo racing car, a four-leaf clover. And then somebody else says it's just a good luck symbol. Well, I'm, I'm sure getting yelled at Irish. about the Irish comment, so I'm really sorry about that. Sure, it's it's the four-leaf clover that, that is made so famous from Ireland, but hey. So, from our comments section, if you agree with me and think I could get better at commentating, I agree with that me better so keep the information coming keep it pouring in this is just adding to all of our knowledge here because it's hard for us to be an expert on every car class yeah, with 500 and, cars, uh, yeah. yeah with 500 cars so we know that there are experts look out. at that i look at his livery on his car and i want a taco juan what are you doing to me i need to lose weight buddy somebody needs to drive a weight watchers car yeah that's a good idea so look at Lisa Hansen. Lisa Hansen is a tactician. Uh-oh, Don Meyer's not out there. Don Meyer's supposed to be right behind Lisa Hansen. Look at that. Oh, who doesn't want a taco right now? Ring that bell. Oh, man. It's, what is it, 9 in the morning, and I'm already wanting tacos. I worry about you It's sometimes. not a good day. I have the easiest job on the staff. I sit up here in the air-conditioned room, watch TV, and talk about it. They're out there in the heat selling these tickets, working the car show. So proud of our staff. I love every one of them. They work so hard to make this happen so that these men and women can come here and have fun on their vacation, race these beautiful cars, and put on a show. Lisa Hansen, Acuri Power, congratulations, our newly crowned SVRA Driver of the Year, and so well-deserved because she is always at the front end. There's my boy Skip Bryant from the Villages. Anybody from the Villages of Florida watching? Today. You know, you go to the a thrill of it all. You go to a McDonald's here, Taco Bell here. There are pictures of the twelve hours of sea break. Yeah, everywhere in every establishment. So the lights are off. Look at that heat. So we should be going, and this is once again our Group Eight and Group Twelve B race two. They've had one race already. There, I have the Top Gun theme in my head. And when you see those planes landing just behind, sometimes uh, down the Almond Strait. Exciting. Well, I've lost my mind, guys, and it's early in the morning. It's, yeah, it's about the tacos it's, uh, will do it. It's usually about four that you go. But it no. is, man. No. Somebody like bring me my Adderall. There's Dave Nicholas, our driver of the year for 2020 in that B sedan. He is a six-time SVRA national champion. That's the Lewis Hamilton of vintage racing, right there. There you go. That's an accolade for you. Here we go then. Green flag waves here at Sebring as they dive towards that first corner, spreading out nicely. And everybody jostling for position, but right in the center is our big sponsor and the man who makes it all happen, Mr. Gonzalez, as he dives into the first corner. A host of BMWs beautifully prepared. Locked about four or five. Alfa Romeo's up in turn seven. Uh -oh. And an, an, yep. an overtake coming here, the BMW under power. As it should. That 914 should be able to outbreak that BMW E36, but then uh, that BMW should be able to get the power. But I got to give it up for Juan Gonzalez because I know that Leo and his team prepare a real. He bypassed the IGT race so that he could race the yeah. new to him 914 <laughs> that I believe was built by Brady at the 901 shop. So that is a 9146, meaning it's a long-running history. But also, if you know anything about Juan Gonzalez and Mission Foods, huge supporter of motorsports. If you are a fan of motorsports and you're not eating Mission Chips and Mission Flour Tortillas, Salsa Queso, then you're not a true fan because he's sponsoring two Indy cars. He's sponsoring Indy car races, speed tour events, Trans Am cars. Kings of industry. So they race and they... Put in, as it were. This is going to be the race, though. Lisa Hansen, 
Juan Gonzalez. Juan looks like he's got a little bit of an arrow advantage, but no offense, Juan, he's got a little bit more downforce than Lisa Hansen. Only again going onto the dust, but gathering it all. Through comes the 81. It's Nicholas Clements. 81A. Great shot where you can see under the car how much space is under there. Now watch the bumps here as they come around 17. Really bumpy through there, that E36. Now this is two different classes of racing. So uh, Ernie Wilding in that 1995 BMW M3. 12, followed by Juan Gonzalez, Lisa Hansen, and Clements in Group 8. So Group 8 is 1972 or older. Group 12 is 1973 or newer. As Juan Gonzalez from Mission Foods goes around his own corner, Mission Foods turn three. The amount of knowledge oh, can, that Mike Joy I can, has. I can is tell you that. That's the truth. He's got statisticians. But he races with us, so yeah, he does. he's the real deal. Yeah, he's a, he's a racer as well. It's good to know. But he look at this in guy. SBR, right? Yeah, he's in the he historic Lagoon, Trans Am class, yeah. He did the tra I think he did the uh, hist historic Trans Am yeah. at uh, Ernie last year. Wilding, what a great name for a race car driver. Yeah, it's pretty good. Ernie Wilding with that beautiful BMW M3 1995 leading in Group 12. GT, Group 12, B, MP immediately. Yeah. Um, but, uh, yeah, so she's out here in her spare time racing with us. Well, here comes your leader to the final corner now. Ernie Wilding in that beautiful BMW Motorsport 182 from the mid-90s. He's going to take the checkered flag as he goes through Sunset Bend. And sure enough, just out of the corner of my eye, I see the checkered flag, and he does it too. Flashes the lights. And like I said, second place, Juan Gonzalez coming down the almost right now. There's third place just behind. And a good outing. And a good clean race. No problems. Hey, Juan, no congratulations. That is a well-built new car. Brady, the 901 shop, built some great cars. Juan Gonzalez winning his class. Mission Foods. Group 8. Way to go, Juan. Butch Leitzinger. Leo, the whole team, Brady, the 901 shop, a lot of effort there. And you know Juan Gonzalez is going to be happy. Lisa Hansen, second place on the podium as always.